So you'll be also injury reports, things like that yes. along the sidelines? Sidelines, injury reports, things that I see. Um, I mean, obviously the team knows and trusts me. So, I mean, literally, if something goes wrong, uh, I'll be able to say, you know, Coach Quinn's over here really trying to make some adjustments with the offensive line and, and all things that first year, the eyes and the side. So what happens when basketball season begins in November? Well, it's a good thing. a lot. Well, and you know, and that's what they've emphasized here that I'm the voice of Notre Dame basketball. We are lucky that Mike Bray is one of the biggest Notre Dame football fans in the world. So I will miss a few games, but something that they really wanted to establish, and this comes from Jack Swarbrick, is they wanted a consistency in all of the shows where Brian Kelly is in radio. So his television show, his radio show on Thursday, uh, post game, they wanted one guy doing all that, so that there was both a knowledge base for the person asking the questions and a comfort level for the people answering. The question. So uh, I will miss a few games. Uh, Coach Bray is aware of that and is fully supportive of having me in that role to support the football program. But it won't be many. Uh, and when you know this first came up, people started discussing this. You know, in the last year and my possible involvement. With this one thing I had to make clear is I would never give up. And uh, that's, that's been my love since 1982. I've been involved in the broadcast. Uh, but uh, coaches, Coach Bray is all in for. Uh, assisting football with their needs, so uh, I'll miss a few, and I don't really want to miss them, but I'll be at some pretty good games. Who's taking your place? No, it hasn't been, has not been named. I don't know, I'm being honest. I, don't know. I think there's some legitimate uh, candidates here, but there's a lot of uh, moving parts yet that hasn't been